Hey everyone. So this one's gonna be kind of a funny one. So um, have you ever heard the phrase, grab the bull by the horns? We've all heard this expression before, right? Usually when someone is encouraging us to take action, that's what it means. But have you ever wondered where it comes from or how it's related to business? That's what you're gonna find out in today's video. So let's start with the origins of the phrase. It turns out that the saying originated in 1800s during a time when bullfighting was popular in Spain. In a bullfight, the bull was traditionally grabbed by the horns to control and restrain it. Hence the saying, grab the bull by the horns. But what does it really mean? Well, figuratively speaking, it means take a bold, decisive action to address an issue or seize an opportunity. In other words, grab the bull, take action, and don't let fear or hesitation hold you back. Now here's how this saying relates to business. The challenge for business is to continually innovate and stay competitive in an ever-changing market. To do this often requires bold decisions by grabbing the bull by the horns. Businesses can break through their fears and make proactive decisions, proactive, that will help them stay on top of their industry. And to illustrate what this looks like in real life, let's take a look at the company called Tile, an app that helps you locate misplaced items like keys, wallets, etc. A Tile story is an example of a business that grabbed the bull by the horns when they realized they weren't able to compete with larger companies due to limited resources they decided to crowdfund their product instead. With a successful Kickstarter campaign, they were able to raise enough funds and launch their product on the market. Ultimately, grab the bull by the horns is about having courage and taking bold action. It reminds us that success often requires risk-taking and that fear shouldn't stop us from making decisions or seizing opportunities. So be bold and grab that bull. Well, that's it for today's video. We hope you enjoyed learning about this interesting saying and how it can be applied in business. Until next time, see you soon.